Hi. I just wanted to take a minute to show you a little treat that I got at Walmart yesterday for using their uh, pickup service. I don't do it very often, but sometimes when I have guests coming and I have to, uh, you know, hurry up and get some things done personally and then get everything ready for the guest, I will put an order in for pickup to Walmart. And it's usually a few groceries, some um, f fruits, uh, maybe some coffee cream or some K-cups or something that I might have figured out that, oh, I'm running low on this because the last guest used more than normal, you know? But anyway, uh, the point of this is, is I wanted to show you the little goodie bags. I ended up getting two. I don't know if that's normal or, you know, if they were trying to curry favor, if they just need to get rid of stuff. I don't know. I've never gotten them before. But I got two goodie bags and I want to unbox them here and show you what's in them. Uh, first, let me just show you, the bags are absolutely cute, except, you know, they have the Walmart logo. They're reusable. They're really sturdy uh, plastic. Uh, I'm not sure what type of plastic it is, but it's um, it's a lot heavier than uh, the normal uh, plastic reusable totes that you get. Uh, I know there's some states that are requiring you to bring your own bags or bring reusables or whatever. And, you know, if you want to live in a state that mandates that, more power to you. Uh, I do it by choice because I just think it's smarter. And I don't like having all those extra bags, even using them in the small trash cans around the house. I don't go through as many as I end up with if I get groceries uh, that aren't put in my own bags. But anyway, so it's cute. It's not very big, not... No, probably, no, I don't know, eight inches. I don't know if it has, no, nah, it doesn't have any kind of markings on it. But uh, it, it, it looks pretty sturdy, and it's, it's, it's not thin. So anyway, in this one, I have <laughs> a full-size bottle of Slow Mag. Muscle Health Recovery, Magnesium Citrate, 60 Gummies. Um, and I thought, ah, oh, they're trying to just clear their stock. Well, if you can make, you can't make it out well enough for me to show you on uh, on the video, but this this expires in one year. So it expires in 9, 20, 23. And um, so, you know, there's 60 here. If I were to use them religiously, uh, I would uh, I would use them. Um, but I don't like gummies. I never did like gummies. There's just something about their texture. I just don't like them. But uh, I may try these or I may donate these. Who knows? Then I got a trial package of Ritz Cheese Crispers. Yeah. <clears throat> I like Ritz. They're like an addiction. Once you get started, I could sit down and eat an entire box of them with just some iced tea or something to wash them down with. They're crazy addictive for me. Trigger food, I think some of those groups call it. Um, but yeah, it's a little trial size bag. And I have a sample package of, I don't know how you pronounce it, Noon, N-U-U-N, sports hydration. Hydrates better than water alone. Uh, tasty sports drink tablets made with optimized electrolytes to replace what's lost in sweat. I think these people think I do some serious exercise. And if they would no pay attention, because you know they track everything, everything. If they would pay attention to the size clothing I'm wearing, they would know better. Or maybe they're trying to tell me something. I don't know. Um, then it tell you know, it has add to your cart now by scanning with the Walmart app. I haven't tried that at Walmart yet, but I've done it at Sam's Club, and I like it better because I can I can tag things, pay for it, and be out the door instead of waiting in line. Let's see. Sometimes these little things have a coupon. And this one does not. It's just a free sample, which is fine. I, did, I mean, <clears throat> I didn't buy it. Not like that, anyway. I buy it from the overall cost of shopping at Walmart. Shopping anywhere, really. And this is a, an advertisement 
bring home nature-inspired favorites with our authentic fragrances. Add Airwick Essential Mist to your cart with the grocery app. So they're promoting the app. Essential Mists. Um, same thing, different scents. Scents, S-C-E-N-T-S, scents on the cards. Oh, well, this is the plug-in. This is the Airwick plug-in. And I'll be honest, I don't use a lot of fragrant, fragrant stuff. Um, many years ago, I just got overwhelmed by everything, having all these fragrances from your detergent and your fabric softener, having two different scents to, you know, plug-in air fresheners and the, your deodorant smells like pineys and your uh, uh, body wash smells like lavender and I mean it just it, your shampoo smells like cinnamon I mean, it just the the overwhelming amount of scents it just was driving me crazy so I very seldom now I do have an air freshener in the living room to help kill <laughs> because anybody who has boxers knows they are a gassy breed and so it helps uh, neutralize some of that gassy smell from the dogs but I don't even use much. I, I have a scented, uh, a scented uh, body powder uh, that I use every now and again, like if I'm going out something special. But other than that, the only scent I wear is whatever my deodorant is, an antiperspirant. I prefer unscented, but it's almost impossible to find. Because think about it. If you have a favorite cologne, let's just say Chanel. You have a favorite cologne, Chanel. So you're gonna put Chanel on lightly because people are sensitive. And then you put an antiperspirant or deodorant that smells like fresh rain or something. Why would you do that? Why would you do it? Because Chanel doesn't make a scented deodorant. Maybe they should. Somebody tell them that. And tell them it was my idea. Here is a promotional flyer from Walmart talking about why I should be a member. Six months free of Spotify premium and much more. Join now. Well... Dummy me, I'm already a member because I actually started the membership to compare it to Amazon and I end up using them both. So there's that. Oh, oh. <laughs> and after I, how's this go? Uh, eat, eat the Ritz and uh, uh, exercise and need the uh, electrolytes and take my slow magnesium to, for, to, for, you know, so my muscles can recover. Use my air freshener to cover up the stench of the sweat. I need to be able to wash my rear end <laughs> with this. Make sure it smells good too. Flushable wipes, these things are not flushable. Don't flush these things, never flush these things. Keep a lidded toilet or a lidded trash can in your toilet if you're using stuff. Actually, you should do it anyway. I have one. It wasn't really expensive. I got it at a cheap store. It's got um, the little pedal that you step on and the lid flops up and you put your, your waist, uh, your hand towels or whatever down in there to keep the germs down. I really do. That's where these belong. They don't belong down the commode. Um, there's just, it just doesn't work the way they promote it. it. It's designed to be flushable, but in reality, they're not. My husband was a plumber before, well, before we met, but yeah, no, don't, ne never flush these, no matter how nice and sweet they try to tell you to. So that's the first one. And it's not a waste. It's kind of funny. It's not a waste. Here's the other one. Like I said, I got two, and the guy handed them to me through the window, and I'm like, what's this? He says, oh, it's a goodie bag, and actually, you get two. And I'm like, did you forget to give the other guy his or something? I don't know, but anyway. Because there was somebody next to me in the other stall. So again, we've got the little cards trying to encourage me to order Airwick or buy Airwick plugins or Airwick essential mists. Um, oh, I actually, I do have a diffuser. It's not this brand. It's a different, a different generic kind of thing. Um, and I do use essential oils in the diffuser from time to time. Um, Recently, because the husband had COVID, uh, I was using eucalyptus oil in it to help, you know, him breathe a little easier. He said he couldn't smell it. He, he, his sense of smell went away years ago um, for a lot of things. 
and I, I mean, I can smell uh, a forest fire and he'll go out in the same area. He's like, I, didn't, I don't smell a thing. So anyway, but I do have a diffuser that I use every now and again. There's some combination of essential oils that are calming and it's not so much, I don't use them for the scent, uh, I guess. I use them for the uh, effect, whether it's psychological or not, I don't know. Here's another, uh, here, join, uh, join Walmart, be a member. <laughs> Here's yet another, they must really think I need the magnesium citrate. Gummies, I hate gummies. Um, another one of those noon, noon N -U, N U U N tablets. And another bottom wipe. Crazy, crazy. But you know, really, I like it for the bag if nothing else. I don't know what triggers these things. If you know what triggers them, let me know. Because I'd love to trigger more than I mean, I like I said, I'll probably donate these. I don't like gummies. And I have a, a, a regime of certain vitamins and minerals that I already take, so I probably would use them anyway. But I like it just for this little bag. I mean, this is as cool as can be. I hope it's been recycled. It doesn't have a stamp on it at all to say whether it's made out of recycled materials or not. But there's that. 12 minutes of <laughs> prattle. But I hope you have a great day. Talk to you later.